Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie here, and I'm here for my first Dokkan video of 2020. Now, if you've been paying attention since uh, last year, uh, near the end of the year I started doing something that I called the Pokemon Pinball, um, which is if I ever ran short of a video, I would immediately switch to Pokemon Pinball. So, new year, I figured, new game. Um... If we finish this game before the end of the year, I'll switch back to Pokemon Pinball, and then, uh, I, then I'll pick a new game to completely play through for all of uh, 2021 um, through just pure Dokkan videos. Basically, um, we'll be playing a JRPG. You'll know it by the, I'm going to guess, the title of this video, and then also once we get into it. But yeah, um, I'm going to see if I can beat it by the end of 2020. Um... It seems impossible. I'm not going to be reading through it all. I'm just going to be literally playing it like an actual video game. So it'll be interesting to see if I'm able to beat it by the end of the year. And if I, again, if I beat it at any point before the year is over, I switch back to Pokemon Pinball. But of course, that only happens if uh, the video goes um, under 20 minutes. No, under 20 minutes, excuse me, under 10 minutes. <laughs> anyway, uh, today's video is, of course, the introduction of this brand new, it's Dokkan 2020. Um, new with the old, old with the new. What is this? I, um, I had a reason for being here, but I only just realized I never did Z-Hard Cooler for some reason. <laughs> so, let's go in here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat up this boy. I'm gonna use, uh, what do you even lead? You lead Otherworld. Never mind, I was gonna say. I'm gonna try using you, but you use Otherworld Warriors. Oh, you know it'd be good? It's an easy fight, so I can definitely use uh, you. And then the team I'll use will be... Let me get rid of this. Alright. I believe yours is this one? Yes. So, of course, the leader is going to be Krillin. He's going to be up there. He's only level 2. The only levels he needs is those two right there, baby. Followed up by... Um... Uh, let me see. How many LRs can I use from this saga? Wow, really? Is Do I not have my... Okay, yeah, so there we go. Look at this beautiful team. Nothing but LRs and Krillin. No sensu beans, that's right, because this is cooler. Um, poor Icarus, that's really funny. <laughs> I never noticed that. Uh, there we go. As you can tell by the fact that I only used this twice. Uh, let's go in here and beat the crap out of Cooler with this team, huh? Alright. Let's beat him down. I'm almost 100% positive we'll be able to win, even though this Krillin is, I'm gonna say, a death sentence if he ever gets hit once. So, all he needs to do is not, not get hit at all. He can do that, right? I totally haven't made a grave error of misjudgment. That's what I choose to believe. Oh, wow. Really, LR Texel? You're really gonna start the new year off with this bullshit? Imagine being an LR and being unable to um, launch a super. I believe that is the argument for everyone. I'm not gonna actually. No, never mind. Oh, no. Death eyes! Cell can tank this. You think Cell could take down Cooler? I'm gonna say right now, I think he could not take down Cooler. I know, technically speaking, by the transitive laws of Dragon Ball, Cooler came before Cell, therefore Cell is stronger, but let's assume that uh, Cooler runs under the same damn laws that his brother does, which is like, if he trains for 10 seconds, he's automatically super strong. So under that assumption, it's like, yeah, you could probably beat him. I could see it. I mean, what is... What does Cell have that Cooler ain't got? Hmm. Good dodge, by the way. You only have a 5 dodge. <laughs> I don't think you're double duped up, so... Yeah, because I didn't have enough key. Wow. So back to my theory about whether or not uh, Cell could beat Cooler. Oh, do oh god, no. This is bad. Uh, it's bad only because Krillin's in the rotation, so I have to pay attention for a bit, and then I'll back into the discussion I was having with myself. One moment, I need to sneeze. Hit him with the crit, dude! You got it, Krillin! Yeah! Fuck him up! 
Oh, we did more than two damage. I'm actually kind of surprised. I didn't sneeze for some dumb reason. Um, yeah, I think Kula could totally beat Cell. He's got the Shredder form. That's what Cell's missing, is that he needs the ability to turn into the Shredder. If you can't turn into the Shredder, I think that you're automatically not as strong as the person who can turn into the Shredder. And if for those of you who don't know who what the Shredder is, the Shredder is the main villain of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which is clearly what Cooler turns into. If someone ever tries to tell me that uh, Cooler's final form was not based off of um, the man with the plan, uh, uh, Shredder, I'm going to call bullshit on that. Because he's so clearly, like... Um, unless someone who, some Japanese person who had never seen Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles saw the design for Shredder, which I don't know, it's possible. Now that I think about it, didn't Toriyama, no, did Toriyama design Cooler? Yeah? No? Hmm. Here's him turning into Shredder, by the way. See, look at that, that's so Shredder-like. That's 100% Shredder. Anyway. Uh, let me see. Wow, I'm really getting lucky with these Krillin. Um, I kind of want to see if I can take Krillin super off rotation because he's messing up with my vibes here. All right, here's the thing, Krillin. You're gonna need to tank this hit because guaranteed uh, Incel is not gonna be able to kill this man. So all I need you to do is to not horribly die. I didn't realize how much freaking um, HP. You know what? These double cells might be able to kill him, now that I think about it. Um, yeah, I don't know, I think... Yeah, you know... I'm not one to do, like, power scaling, because they always have to use, like, some kind of dumbass logic, which is like, oh man, uh, Cell was able to punch Goku two times faster than the speed of light, so therefore he can easily punt Cooler into the, into the sun, with a flick of his wrist, even though he's flicking his wrist to punt a man. Oh, please, Krillin. Tank this. Do not die on me, boy. Don't die on me. Uh, okay. See, look at that. Like a real champ, he took it in the face. And I lost where I was going with that metaphor. Fight for the future, Trunks. Um, let me see. What was I saying? Um... Shit. Yeah, so I always feel like power scaling goes off of some logic where it's based off feats. I understand why you do it that way, because that's really the- unless you have two offers come together and be like, no, this is how the way it should be, there's just no way in hell that you'll ever get it correctly. Oh, we got times four. I just also noticed that we do not have enough time to, um, good job, Krillin, by the way. We do not have enough time for me to do the, the next game over, because <laughs> two minutes of a JRPG is freaking nothing. So, you're just going to have to wait in anticipation for the next one. So what am I going to do for two minutes? First of all, I'm going to train up my Krillin because he deserves it. And then we'll go back to me discussing Cell versus, um, Cell versus Cooler and the ultimate death fight in my head. Okay, let's see. I wish Zen were here. If Zen were here, he would be able to tell me what he thinks. Because Zen usually is the kind of guy who's like... Um, you ask him a question, and then he's like, Oh yeah, I totally remember that brief moment when um, Cell used a Kamehameha to destroy all of Canada in that one uh, that one page in the middle of chapter 217. Like, he's perfect for that. Um, for me, it's more like, okay, so what has Cooler done? Let's, first of all, let me look at Cooler. I have a Cooler. But I have the old cooler. I have physical cooler. I don't, I'm not cool. I'm not a cool guy. But it's fine because physical cooler is the Super Shredder cooler. Not Super Shredder. Super Shredder is bigger than regular Shredder. I guess actually now that I think about it, it's more like Super Shredder. Put a gun to my head, I'll say Super Shredder. Um, I just realized both those freezes look exactly the same. Where the hell are you? There you are. Okay. So what has Cooler done? I think at one point he punched a man in the nuts. Um, no, that was Android 13. Cooler drowned, tried to drown a man in a pool of water. Perfectly good. He shot down a baby dragon. Amazing feat. Has Cell ever even tried to attack a dragon? No. Never seen it in all of Dragon Ball. Cell is currently losing in the department, which is attacked a baby dragon. 
So I think Cooler could totally do it. They could even fight on the sun. How come Dragon Ball has never fought someone on the sun? Now that I'm thinking about it. How come they don't fight on the sun? Well, first of all, because <laughs> the, the sun is hot and they'll die. But I'm just saying. Huh. With that terrible pun, I think I have to leave because I did that unintentionally. So I'm going to think about this more. And hopefully in next Dokkan video, you'll actually see me play the mysterious game coming forth. Goodbye, everyone. Have a good day. Stop recording.